Hello again and welcome back to Super Mario All-Star as well as Super Mario Brothers 3. So we're now in World 5 and this is the Cloud World. Not much from this level but as you can see over there in the right looks more like a silver poop. That is where our destination is, one of the castles. So with that out of the way, let's not waste time and get over to this. Okay, so I'm gonna have to fly my way. Try to avoid the chomp chomp and all that stuff. Oh, that was a close one. One of those weird looking plants. They can't reach me, so lucky for me. Let me just get some coins just for the heck of it. And as you can see, we've made it to the finish line. I'm guessing that this is going to be a quick video, just like in my last one. Alright, let's just get this over. Oh, it looks like this is the pipe world. Just trying to avoid that. Let's see where this leads me. supposed to go here. Alright, car. Of course. Let's see what's in store for me in this thing. Nope, I'm not gonna get that. Ooh. At least not just one, but three ups. Extra lives. Thank you very much. And we made it to the finish line. Very simple. And I got myself the Tanuki suit. Real nice. For some of you who do not know what a tanuki is, it's a rare looking raccoon, almost the size as a dog. I'm not sure if that's the case, but something like that. Well, we made it to the first castle in this world. And this has to be a puzzle. Or not. You know what? I should have just used the power leaf thing with this. That way I can just easily climb up there. Of course, that's not going to happen, so I'm going to have to find the alternate route. And that was a mistake. Ooh, that was a close one. Actually, no, I've already made it to the Boom Boom boss, so... Actually saying that is pretty awkward. I never thought of that. But whatever, I've already defeated him. Pretty simple. You know what, I'm just going to take care of these guys with the map, the star, power. Easy. Lemon squeezy. 
And I got my wing. Second time the charm. Now we can do the third part. Okay, let me take care of these guys for a moment. Or not. Ooh, I almost forgot. So this is what the... Um, Peach was talking about those giant shoe things. Let me see if I can get one of them. There it is. So, when you get into this giant shoe, you can be invincible. It can help you go into places like walk through spikes. And it's easier to jump on those spinies. And this is what I'm talking about. I wonder if it's work on these guys. Mm, good, it does. So let's move on without getting killed. And I lost my thing. It doesn't even matter because I'm always close to the end. Right here. And I was purposely trying to get a different card instead of the star. But who cares. So you may think that it's the end of the level, right? But like I said, this building right next to me, that shape as a silver poop, is actually a castle. So let's go into this and see what we find. I don't think there's any boss fight over there. Mid-boss, that's what I'm going to be saying from now on, because saying boom boom boss is kind of awkward. So let's just move on. Well, that's new. I'm already on the top of the castle. From the looks of this. Let's see what I can do. Nothing, okay, so let's move on. So, let's climb up. Actually, there is something. An extra l world. So basically, this is the Cloudland, or Skyland, or whatever it is. And we have the land over there, background over there. Alright, enough said. Let's go into this world. Gotta be careful not to fall down to my death. Because I'm already in the sky world. Of course I'm already finish it, so what difference does it make? Oh, 
I'm just gonna come back for that later. Let me see if there's a secret entrance to this part. There it is. And I got myself the Tanuki Leaf. I hate this part of the level. Okay, so... Sorry for that, I had a lot of editing to do. Plus, there was some noise going on in the background. I'm gonna have to cut a few things just to fix everything. Of course, I died so many times. Just messing up with that tail whip. All right, let me see. I gotta be careful for that flaming cannon thing. Whatever, I've already made it to my destination. And we got 50 lives. All right, let me see if I can take care of these guys. Yes, I can. Another music box. Oh, that's right, I keep forgetting that I have the stone power, so I can turn into a stone if any enemy comes by. I don't think I should have gone to that area. That was a close one. So we're here in our second castle. Let's just try not to lose our Sue. That's new. The lava pit is upside down in the ceiling, so that's new. And that was a close one. I'm skipping that. And we made it. Let me see if this works on the one of the bosses. Ah, oh, it does. And he made me lose my thing. I didn't even know that he was gonna fly. And do that. Alright, I'm not gonna waste my time with him, so let's just finish him off. And that basically explained about the white glove looking arm that he appears. He can fly. So let's just beat the last two level until we can get to the castle to see what's going on.
You know what? I'm just gonna not waste my time with this. Ah, you. You know what? I'm just gonna not start over. Let's try this. And I am pressing the wrong button. Yeah, let's see if you can try to get me from here. Nice try. You gotta try harder. And it's gone. But it doesn't even matter because I'm already made it to the finish line. You know, from this point on, I'm trying to not as not talk as much as I can because it's pretty simple and basic. At least for some of it, like this one episode. I mean, not episode, but level particularly. Just making it difficult for me because everything is moving the camera I know and we got ourselves that thing again not this time And we made it. Give me five, please. Let's go back to the hut just to get some stuff we need. Shut up. That's done. And this one. We got everything, so let's move on. You know, I should have just edited that part. That toad's talking and all that, so I can just move on. But enough said. Let's see what the problem is. Man, why do I keep pressing that wrong button? Start. And looks like he turned into the crane from the last game. Nah, whatever. You know, I should have just gotten the flute just to skip the whole thing. But I don't want to be a jerk just to leave the kings hanging. Deal with their problem. Like right now, that I'm trying to repeat the whole thing again. And that's something that I never realize. Whenever I lose a life, I just turn to small again. But if I lose a life with, well not the life, but my power, I become small again from the first game but when I play in this one I just lose my power and just keep my original form that was a close one alright so who's gonna be the Koopaling for today This guy. Basically, if you. He'll just shake everything if he falls down. Just makes it harder to hit him, see? But it doesn't matter because I've already took care of him. And I got the wand, so. Hooray for me.
Santa Claus. As the king. Be careful in the ice world. The creatures trapped in the ice will come to life if warm. Well, anyone who's dumb enough to use the fire power, rather die. So this is the ice world, but we're going to have to save that for another video. So thank you for watching this. If there's anything that you like about this content, be sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe. That will be helpful. So until then, I will see you again in the next video.